Welcome back guys, today we are working on the Civic Today. We are working on putting a new radio in. Shout out to Atoto for sending this out. If you guys are interested, make sure to check out the link down below. I will have a discount code. Save you guys a little bit of money on buying a new radio. I did have to go get the harness separately. This is the harness for it and the part number 701721, which is the harness that plugs into this particular Civic. As of right now, I think, believe it also works for 92 through 95 as well. And that's really it. Also, this kit also comes with a Atodo's rear camera. So we are also gonna be wiring that and plugging that in today. I have a aftermarket radio when I bought this car. However, you can see right here, this bracket I think is broken or it just doesn't sit right because this rattles a lot when I drive and also it's a single din, not a double din. So single din is just like this and a double din is a full on screen. I always am so used to Apple CarPlay with my previous cars and I always think it's a necessity because it's so much easier and Apple CarPlay is so good. You cannot go wrong with it. It's simple, it's clean. You can play your music. If someone calls you, it's easier to reply and give some feedback on that on the info entertainment system than rather just having a single din or a stock radio in general so it's definitely a bigger upgrade and i'm excited for that for today um but like i said uh check out a toto their customer service is actually pretty good when i handle with them when i was trying to work with them make sure to check out their website and see what's up on the link down below we have another boy today we got blueberry civic back in action <laughs> are we professionals yes we are professionals. First thing we're gonna do is take off this bottom piece. I believe this piece as well. So that way we could also take out this black trim that holds the AC. <laughs> Panels of the dash is out and now we just need to replace the radio. All right, so the radio is finally out of the AC bezel. Now we are gonna try to wire up the new plugs for it. Maybe. And just like that, we have the bracket on the radio. Let's try this thing. Shh. There we go. Now it's working. Alrighty, so it's been a few hours later. I ain't gonna lie. Um, we were just making sure everything works. We have the rear camera back here and we test it out just to see if it works and it does work the way how we wired it. We're just trying to figure out how to wire this, make it as clean as possible. What we're trying to do is just route it all the way through this door trim, run it all the way back to the hatch so that way it could be connected to the camera. So that way when we put it in reverse, you could see it. All right, so we just wired in the rear camera. Let's see if this works. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right, guys, so it's been a few weeks later. I've been testing out this unit just to see how it does and how well it performs and if it's snappy, is it quick? And also the rear camera as well. We have the rear camera back on the Civic. We finally were able to get all this up. It looks flush, it looks factory. I know some other rear aftermarket cameras, they usually have like a plate here and doesn't make it look clean. But as you can see, this has a bracket behind it. So it actually makes it a little bit cleaner and it makes it look more OEM if it were to come on the car like that. We finally got every trim piece back in. Let me show you guys a little bit of features on the Apple CarPlay. You could go through your menus and you have music, phone, messages, very useful user friendly. Also as well as that it has the volume controls right here so you can lower or find the volume, skip a songs if you want to repeat it or you want to move forward. And then right here, it's kind of hard to focus. Oh, here it is. So here is the home button or the speaker button. So if you click the home button, it'll bring you back to the original page where if you want to put Android Auto or something like that um, for Android users. And then it has other different apps that you could use. So as you can see, we're sitting right here. Let's say if I wanted to play a particular song and I was driving, I'll actually pick up my voice, which is the mic right here. So check this out. Hey Siri, play Pure Cocaine by Lil Baby. Here's Pure Cocaine by Lil Baby and then it'll actually play the song while it's playing. And y'all guys can hear a little bit. I do not want to play this super long because actually I could get copyrighted for that. Obviously this car is a 90s car. Um, not a, not a, none of them come with Apple CarPlay and if it does, it's aftermarket. Uh, not only we put Apple CarPlay, but we also put a rear camera 
Rear camera. I mean, you've never seen a rear camera on the 90s. Like I said, they don't even come in the 90s with rear camera. If y'all guys are interested in the Atodo radio or the Atodo rear camera, check it out in the link down below. I'll have it linked in the description. So the same model as I am, but they also make different radios for different vehicles as well. They make it for Tacomas. They make it for Forerunners. They make it for Miatas, Civics, Day Souls, whatever it is. It's very versatile and very universal. They have different brackets and different kits. I have a discount code down below. Make sure to check it out and yeah, see you a little bit of some money and modernize your car a little bit better but yeah hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys next time in the next one